impression did Azerbaijan make on you at first glance? So the first impression I had about Azerbaijan was this city is really nice and with a lot of architectural diversity and I was really impressed by this with the difference between the old and the new buildings and moreover the people were, were really friendly with us and we were very welcoming so that was a great first impression. Please explain Azerbaijan in three words. So first one is hospitality, the second one is petrol, the third one is uh, home feeling. Uh, because uh, when I stay here, I feel like back to China. The environment, the, um, the people are very friendly everywhere. And yes, petrol makes the taxi uh, very cheap. If you would have lived in Azerbaijan, what job or position you could choose from? So we see a lot of opportunity in the green economy. So notably, I think in the waste management but also in the development of the banking system, uh, in asset management. But for me, I think uh, the position I will prefer will be in the retailing of wine. What UNEC means for you? For me, UNEC is a great opportunity to make students aware about the uh, Azerbaijan strategy of the government. And yes, uh, it's not easy to, to study at UNEC. Uh, people have to pass exam and only the best uh, are taken. And uh, yeah, to finish, uh, I think uh, yes, it's a good university for, for, for travel. Uh, then uh, I don't know what I want to say, <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's a, it's a good opportunity to, to networking with uh, the government, yes. What did you get from intensive global program at UNEC? So we learned about uh, many, the functioning of many fields in Azerbaijan and also the strategy applied in the country or the willingness to, to have the green economy. And also we learned about the differences and similarities between Switzerland and Azerbaijan. Would you like to pursue your future studies at UNEC? Uh, studying in Tunic, I would like to, yes, but unfortunately I have a work that not, does not allow it to me. But maybe I will come back for some collaboration for my master thesis. Who knows? I would like to, yeah. Which is your favorite Azerbaijan national meal? Okay, so my favorite meal would start off with some cabbage dolma and of course with some uh, plov and with some uh, kebab lamb chops and of course to finish with some traditional chai. What sightseeing places did you visit in Azerbaijan? So on the weekend we visited Shirvan National Park where we saw lots of uh, hundreds of gazelles and birds. Uh, then we went to Gobustan, uh, we went to see the Gobustan mud volcanoes. We also went to see the Bersh Bermak mountains. Um, and then we visited a bit back also the flame towers and some museums. What could you say about people or locals living in Azerbaijan? So we met very welcoming people, charming and very kind, kind persons. And yes, it was very uh, good experience to exchange with them. Yeah. Thank you. Would you want to live in Azerbaijan? Yes, sure. I think um, Azerbaijan as a country and especially Baku is a very um, growing city with a lot of opportunities and especially for its culture, the nice people and its food for, for sure. Say something in Azerbaijan language, any words is possible. Salam, Gona Pavela, Gora, Tasaku, Ediram, Piz, Azerbaijan, Severik. What is your recommendation for further development of relations in various fields between Switzerland and Azerbaijan? Since Azerbaijan and Switzerland started their bilateral relations since the early 90s and, and multiplied them since, so we see further development um, priority in um, establishing a free trade agreement, for example, and or notably in education, be it at the government level or directly at the academic level. Um, in our opinion, the exchange of students, uh, as we did uh, so far, should continue. And uh, also, uh, it's very important for the, as a first step to establishing relations between Switzerland and Azerbaijan. Uh, we love you!